So, what is about to occur is of a stunningly momentous nature. Channel by John Smallman. April 1, 2012. A lot has happened since I last spoke to you, as you all were to complete the final preparations that will enable you to awaken into reality. It is an event that will soon come to pass. I know you dislike that word, but there truly is no satisfactory replacement for it, so soon is the word we have to use. The light you all carry and display continues to brighten as you discard old and unloving attitudes and behaviors. All across the world that light is having a miraculous effect as it ripples outwards and blends with the energy of all who are working steadily and determinately to bring about the changes necessary to move humanity forward into the long, awaited and enthusiastically anticipated new age. As you well know God's love embraces all of life because he created it. Life is an eternal gift from him, offering an infinite selection of experiences from which you can choose in order to learn about him and understand how much he loves you. In the illusion, as you live life as a human, the pain and suffering you see and experience might well lead you to think that this could not be the case. However, the illusion is illusory and so are your experiences within it. Nevertheless, it does present you with lessons that will lead you out of it and home to reality if you will release yourselves from the myriad inflexible beliefs in which it appears to entangle you. More and more of you are doing this as you become increasingly aware that egoic, separatist agendas and behaviors only lead to further conflict and suffering. For life to be enjoyable all must cooperate to create a harmonious and integrated environment, while accepting and respecting the individuality that each one of you has chosen to experience. For eons, despite the gargantuan efforts of a few enlightened beings, humans have chosen to engage in distrust, disharmony, and conflict as a way to protect themselves from the dangers with which others apparently threaten them. The destructive results of this conduct have become increasingly disastrous as your technical abilities have advanced and brought you ever more efficient weapons with which to threaten and kill one another. As the forces of technology at your disposal have become more effective, your fear has increased exponentially, and it now seems to many of you that in order to survive you must strike your enemies preemptively before they attempt to destroy you. The fear that so many of you now embrace so massively and enthusiastically makes it very difficult for you to think clearly, or even to think at all. However, the illusory bubble in which all this fear and suffering is enclosed is enveloped in the infinite divine love field which is about to dissolve it. The insanity of your situation is dawning on everyone, and consequently, an ever-increasing majority of you are looking for better ways to resolve your differences and conflicts. The power of love to change everything, as it enables you to see with new eyes and from new perspectives, is becoming recognized. Love shows you that you all want the same outcome, peace, safety, and abundance, and that that outcome is available when you operate from love instead of from fear. Ever greater numbers of you are letting go of your fear-filled, unloving attitudes and discovering the joy and confidence it brings to you in your daily lives. You are truly blessed as humans to be on earth at this moment in her evolution, because what is about to occur is of a stunningly momentous nature, way beyond the power of words to describe, or of your restricted minds to imagine. Just rest assured that all will occur precisely as God intends and that your joy when it is so will be beyond anything you have ever imagined or experienced. All in the spiritual realms are constantly strengthening the flow of love that each of you is sharing and extending in your daily lives as you work continuously towards the moment of humanity's awakening. You are never alone, you are constantly watched over and supported. So open your hearts in joyful acceptance of the love and assistance that is offered to you in every moment and let go of any remaining doubts you may be nurturing about the truth and validity of the divine plan for you all. You are heading forward to your awakening with the power of heaven beside you, and nothing can prevent the glory of that moment from enveloping you in pure and abundant ecstasy. With so very much love, salt. Website, johnsmallman.wordpress.com.com